Hi, and welcome to another B tutorial. B stands for Best Email Editor. That's our goal. We want to create one of the best email editors around. Today we're going to show you how to create anchor links in email. Anchor links let readers skip ahead without scrolling to different sections of your email. So when you have a really long content-rich email like this newsletter from Lena Dunham, the Lenny letter. Um, there's a lot of scrolling, a lot of content actually in the email itself. So instead of forcing readers to scroll and scroll, which takes a lot of time, especially on mobile devices, anchor links at the top of the email let you just go ahead and skip to the section you want to get to. So if I know I want to read Lena's story first, I can click right here and be taken right to it. These links are really easy to implement in B. So we went ahead and recreated this email in the B editor, um, the beginning of it at least. We have our image header um, and then the text uh, up at the top that we can link down to sections below. So we'll show you how to create an anchor link in this first section so you can skip right to Jess Kugros' story. All you need to do is navigate over to the content and drag in an HTML block. And we're going to position it right here where we want the email to skip to when you hit the link at the top. So if we put our HTML right here, we're all set. And all we need to do is click on it to activate it, and then we can replace this text with specific code. And that code, which I'm going to paste in, is just this very simple line um, where we're going to name our anchor link. And between the quotes, I'm going to call it just gross, the last name of the author. Um, and then we're all set to go, really. Our HTML anchor is here. And to make the link work at the top, I just simply need to highlight this to activate the link and make sure that I have hashtag gross in the URL field. Now the link is active. And when I click on it, it should take me right to this section. Now I can't test it right here, so all I need to do is send a test email to myself to see if the link is working by going to the Actions menu and hitting Send Test. Once the Send Test field opens up, you can go ahead and enter your email address, send it to yourself, and check that it's working. But that's it. It's as simple as one, two, three.